Welcome to May's All Minute. It's Kristen and Nasia. And today we're going to talk about some of our favorite spots around Atlanta to get coffee and good eats. Coffee. <laughs> <laughs> so um, one of my favorite spots is Amalie's. This is in town and it is the most amazing French restaurant ever. Now, <laughs> it has oh, great coffee and drinks. One of my favorites um, is the lemonade and it's infused with lavender. Mm. It's amazing. And then you might have to go there after this. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and they have a bakery that you can get all kinds of sweet French pastries um, that you probably have never even dreamed of before. And it has the most eclectic decor that I probably have ever mm -hmm. seen. And it also has an event space as well. Yeah, it's very shabby chic, but with a French twist. And she talks about the pastries and the coffee and the lemonade, but the food is also good. Their mm -hmm. sandwiches are amazing. Their salads are so good. So yeah. if you're looking for good coffee, it's also a cool place to just hang out. There's always yeah. like lots of people that they're mm -hmm. just they're like hanging out. Pack. Right. Yeah. So that's a great place. Okay. Mm -hmm. So one of my favorite places around town um, to grab a good cup, cup of coffee or if I'm in the mood for maybe a glass of wine is Buzz Coffee House and Wine, which is located in the Cascade area of town. It's cute, it's quaint, they also have tasty um, treats. Um, their sweet potato coffee cake is off the chain. Yeah, delicious. And their coffee, because I love coffee, as you can see, um, their coffee is really amazing, mm -hmm. and they really put a lot of effort into finding out um, what kind of coffee beans there are, and really making a brew that really anybody from a coffee connoisseur on down to somebody who's just a casual drinker will love. Absolutely, and again, the wine. Um, <laughs> if you go in there, a lot of times you'll find the owner like manning right. the register, mm -hmm. and you know you can, you know, sometimes I want coffee, and sometimes I need a glass of wine. Um, so you know he'll talk about the wine list, like delicious, delicious wines from you know that are sourced from around the country and around the world. So um, highly recommend Buzz um, Cascades area town. And my next hidden gem is the Senegal. The Senegal is a great little spot in order to enjoy, um, I love breakfast foods, so they have breakfast foods as well as just these great homemade foods. They have a really good coffee, again, coffee kind of <laughs> uh, They have really good coffee and they make great drinks and everything that they make is really amazing um, and they have really great service as well. And that's an Austell and I will say I recommend Highly the pecan waffle, and they've got some great grits as well. Ooh, grits! I love grits. <laughs> um, so in my next place, um, I love Greek food. So if you like Greek Mediterranean mm -hmm. food, this is one of my favorite kind of. It's it's not really hidden because it's always on and popping in <laughs> there. Fast. But in fact, <laughs> but like a lot of people aren't aware of it, and they now have a second location, um, Cafeneo, which is in Historic College Park. I find every excuse to, someone wants to meet with me, to go to meet there, that's like my spot. Um, everything is delicious, like their spetacopita mm -hmm. is delicious. Lamb burger. The my lamb favorite. burger is like one of my favorite things. Their orzo salad is good. Mm -hmm. And have you ever had their desserts? Yes. <sighs> their desserts, their cake. Coconut cake. Yes, mm -hmm. coconut mm -hmm. cake. So delicious. So also, you know, they have plenty of room there. Um, if you come at the right time, um, you know, you got to hit that, like, 11.30 time and beat the That's lunch right. rush. Um, but there's, like, you know, nice seating. If it's a nice day, there's mm -hmm. seating, outside seating. And it's in a really cute part of, you know, Historic College Park. So it's always a nice place, you know, to hang out. There's lots of restaurants on that road, but Caffeineo has been kind of, like, a go-to for me for years now. So <laughs> I love it. So highly recommend it. So... Um, definitely check out those places, tell me what you um, think, tell us what you think, um, and if you have any, you know, hidden treasures or your great hangout spaces, let us know. We'd love to visit them because we like coffee and good food. Yeah, <laughs> there are so many great restaurants around the metro Atlanta area, and we're just naming four spots that we personally frequent a lot, um, yeah. but there's so many more that we can um, have talked about, we could yeah. have talked about. So uh, make sure that you subscribe to our channel Yay. and we would love to hear from you.